Hi guys, welcome to episode 39. Oh god, my hair's back. I hope you can see me <laughs> beyond this hair. So, um, we have had like two days, three days of not having a live video because um, trying to. I'm just trying to get the lighting right currently don't know why the lighting is not so great okay so i'm gonna just try to get my lighting right and then we can we can start oh it's getting worse okay ah it's better now okay that's good so um i'm not a winter person so i've been trying to <laughs> get myself into the the winter season i've been trying to adjust to winter so yeah it's going well it's going well it's been cold but I, I, i'll survive <laughs> i love summer i love warmth i love the sun i prefer um to wear less than to wear a lot so but um that's going well so today um episode 39 i want us to talk about money flow how do you keep money flowing to you and um well the good thing is that this month on our money master class we actually talking about this we're talking about mastering your money flow how do you master your money flow how do you um maintain a specific money flow so it's it's not like today you have the next day you don't have it's not like um you get paid on the 25th you do have money for three days and then all of a sudden there's nothing or you this month your sales your company sales are great the next month there's nothing so because that is not just because there isn't money or it's december or people are not paying it's just it's you who is um orchestrating that so 25th we have our money master class Pretoria and we're gonna be discussing that more but um, today I just want us to look at a few other things that pertains to your money flow how do you keep money coming to you so um, firstly um, yeah that's the one thing that's happening the event that is on the 26th I've posted the poster and it's on cricket.com uh, if you want to buy your ticket online other than that just send an email and rsvp and it's only 150 it's a morning session starting at 10 it's at um Rene's conference center in pretoria in in dorenburg the side of montana but not montana really but you can just find it on google that's great <laughs> um okay so we have that event on the 26th on, in the morning and please come through if you can i'll try to broadcast from there but like normally does it work well so um just try to come through and then we have the new uh well it's not that new but um we're starting another round of the skills course it's starting on the 17th of june yes 17th of june we're supposed to start in the beginning of june but um at because we're just finishing another course i'm currently finishing another course that i'm i'm i'm, I'm practicing I'm, I'm experimenting with that i want us to do in the in the for 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 the spring time so i thought let me um give myself a little bit of time so that i can actually do the skill course i always want to do with the crop it's just one special course that i always want to be hands-on and help um whoever is in that group to be able to get it right because i think it's the most most important course of all the courses i do because it takes someone who is great but is not seeing their greatness take someone who says you know what i am not loving my life as it is i'm not loving my life as i'm living it right now i know i've got greatness i know i can do better things but it's not happening this course takes someone like that and opens um their eyes to what they actually here for allows them to earn so much money from things that they love and enjoy um the the, the, the one person that has always made me really respect what the universe gave me when it when, when i received uh, this course and I, I wrote it 
was a lady who came to me um she was quite stressed with that she was um a single mom and she was just not coping and she was working in a job she hated she was in it in an it department in in, in, in a corporate job and um it wasn't her and the the one thing that um happened all the time every almost every day when she got to work was for her she was seeing people who did not have the greatest makeup so she would go to people and be like hi man you should supposed to do like this you're not supposed to put this color here. you're not supposed to do this let me help you fix this let me help you fix this so she would do that almost every other morning and um she would then go to her it job and she just did not like it it was not her so then she um came through to the course well she did not come through to the course because she hated her job she was like you know what as long as it pays the bills i mean she was earning about 20 25 20 up to a 30 grand a month and she was saying you know i just want to be able to afford my my life currently i don't there's so much debt i do not do help me out so i said to her you know um get into the skill course because you actually saying you don't like your job so maybe just do um find out what you do love to do so then um you don't have to also suffer in a job you hate because obviously everyone who hates their job will have debt almost everyone so and it, it's connected definitely connected so she then uh started up for the course she started and um four months later she found out that she really loves doing makeup but then um she never thought makeup could give her money but then now she willingly through what she learned in the course because we, we set up business plans we do all sorts of things we clear the energy and we actually do physical things that makes it that you start earning money from this the skill you want to to you you have like the skill that you don't actually need even to to go and study it further to go you just have it it's just in you you know how to do this thing so well you don't need it but to tell you how to do it so four months later she found herself with a great contract where she was working fridays and saturday evenings she was working for about six hours she was earning 10 grand an hour me doing makeup um for artists that were to perform and on the show so she was earning 60 grand a day and 120,000 in a weekend which is like four times what she earned so that was a four month salary and she was getting this in two days and i mean for for her to get there it, it looked like it was an overnight thing but it, it wasn't overnight because she really did put in work she did put in work for about four months of fixing her vibration of fixing her mindset around her skill and money flow in her life and obviously i mean when you earn 120,000 in one weekend there's no one who should be telling you that you shouldn't be going to a job that gives you 30 and and that's the thing a lot of people when they come to me and they say you know what i want to change careers i say to them never never leave your job but um i say to them when you do the work when you when you do the exercises i give you you will not come and ask me if it's time because it will be clearly it, you, you will just see it you, you you wouldn't i mean when you have 120 every week it means that you have um about 500k 600k a month and um yeah like dad you still need a job like you don't need me to tell you what if you need one or don't need one so and it's not that you people shouldn't have jobs i mean um having a job is the one of the greatest things because you continuously give to the universe on a continuous basis on a daily basis stream um streaming one flow that is great and that's when the universe is able to give you so much back but you must love the job so everybody who has a job that they love they are great in that but the things that they need to allow themselves to receive all the things they want because the things that the job might not be paying you the amount that is um going to take care of everything that you want so the job is not going to buy you a holiday for six months somewhere it's not going to do those things but if you want a holiday for six months somewhere you don't have to get it through the job the moment you give your all in the job which you do love then the universe will give you exactly what you do want which is that six months holiday that is fully paid for not from the job somewhere where the universe knew that that could be the way that you get what you want so 
having a job is one of the greatest things because you continually are giving back to the universe on a consistent basis you're not like some of us who sometimes like oh god i know i'm supposed to be giving something to the universe but i'm like today i'm gonna sleep because it's winter i can't just like winter is not my thing so i'm just gonna give myself a week leave <laughs> and then yeah and then it's, you just know that you you're being um lazy or whatever but when you have a job you have that opportunity to do it on a daily basis which is why even the the the, the, the vibrational work must be done on a daily basis you have to be consistent you have to it has to be a continuous process for it to work at the best like totally great okay so the skills course is starting on the 17 i think or, yeah 17 of june i've posted about it if you want to know what is your primary skill the skill that you don't need to go and fix it up and change it up for you to make money just because we all have that skill that i i did uh, a few courses on public speaking but before i even did the courses i was already earning money in public speaking so i didn't actually need training on it for me to earn money but and and, and there's other skills that i do have that i don't even I don't I did not need to go and cultivate them to earn money from them so I mean you don't need to have a job you don't need to have experience you don't need to have all this this skill is in you the universe gave you that skill so that's your primary skill so if you don't know that then it's a, in, an issue because that is the skill that you can earn the most money through like the most money in the most easiest way but that is when you know it and you recognize it and you have allowed your subconscious mind to accept it as a way of you earning money. So there's a whole lot of people that say, you know what, I know, I know, I know I'm great at baking, I know I'm great at cooking, I know I'm great at photography, I know I'm great at this, I know I'm great at design, interior design, I know I'm great at this, but you know what, I have a job that pays my bills, then I can do this thing, you know, at the back or wherever. But it's because you've been told that your hobby or the thing that you love the most or you know how to do the most or you enjoy the most is not gonna pay your bills so even if you can start it today and be like hey people i'm now a photographer no one's gonna come to you you're not gonna make money out of it because your subconscious mind is thinking that this is not the way for you to pay your bills you need a proper job to pay your bills so the skills course that's what we do we change your thinking around your hobby not giving you money from your hobby actually giving you money. so this lady was coming to work every day and she thought this was a hobby because she will she would fix people's makeup she would fix people's makeup at weddings she would fix people's makeup and wherever she's fixing people's makeup like they go out with the girls she's fixing their makeup she thought it was a hobby she'd never charged anyone for it and all of a sudden her hobby has changed her life she got financial freedom from her hobby but she had to change the way she thought about the hobby so a lot of people will be like i want to leave my job i know i'm good at this i want to go try it out the moment you go and try it out the the, the problem is that and, and 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 a lot of um statistics come out and it says you know businesses fail um the 80 percent of businesses fail their first two years not because these people have thought of bad ideas not because they don't have the skills not because they don't know what they're doing but it's because they don't believe that doing this thing that they love the most is the way to make them money that is the only way because this person if you can look at them um we, with a job and doing this they will be so great at this this thing will will be great but they will just don't they will not just not make money because that's what they think and so i'm just <laughs> trying to sit a little bit better so that is um that is um what the skills course is all about so if you want to join in please send a there's a there's a link that i posted click on that link and register or send an email or send me an inbox i'll send you the link you can be able to register there and you're starting on the 17 it's gonna be so great so guys i was in not seeing your eyes i cannot see your eyes hi guys hi 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 everyone i don't know what i did and then i was not seeing the the comments now i see them and they are open okay so just keep writing whatever that you want to say like i'll read it when i'm done with this episode so 
um so this is cause starting so definitely if you will laugh so another thing is if you are thinking of starting a new business definitely join in the skill course because then you can set up your business to be the right vibe so you you know a lot of people when they set up businesses they thinking about how am i going to get clients how am i going to get clients how am i going so you are now just thinking how am i going to get clients and then you lose focus on what you actually do the best so if you were cooking or if you were um uh baking cakes you will not be thinking how am i gonna get more clients how am i gonna get clients? then you're not baking a lot because you need to bake a lot and enjoy the baking because that's the only way that you are allowing that vibe to flow so then um you 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 are not the one who's supposed to be focused on the marketing of your business the your business and your vibration is supposed to market it the business to the world people who want cake supposed to come to you not the other way around so that you can have time to bake then people are coming to you and wanting more cakes and wanting more cakes so that's what also this girl course is about okay so that you can just see why i think it's the best course ever there are other courses that i've done that are great but this one i just think is the best of all of them okay so if you can't afford the whole amount for the course just tell me and we can just make a plan i i really want everyone who needs this course to be on it so please do not say i don't have the money for it do not say you know what i'll do it and next time just get on with it because you know what the only thing that is the most painful in in in, in our lives is regretting regretting not doing something that you knew that you were supposed to do something you know that your life needs a, a, a makeover you know you know that you not living the best life ever that you wanted to live so do something about it and this is an opportunity the universe knew that you needed this um so so you don't have to be um doing what is not working when you know that something else could work i mean like what else can you you know it's not like you're gonna lose something by doing this you're actually gonna grow either way <laughs> okay so tabitha says um but if you don't market how will they know me yes tabitha exactly we were taught that if i don't market my business how do they know so so one example tabitha when i started business got into the business industry um what 17 years ago i was told that you needed money to make money and i really believed it and i actually went out and borrowed so much money from banks and started businesses that worked and then failed and then i had to pay all that money back which caused me to go bankrupt and sequestrated and lost everything i mean i lost furniture houses cars everything because i believed that i needed money to make money so the, the thing is that we, we are taught that when you start a business, you must sell it, you must market it. And we are taught to market it in the physical way, where we need to do something like physically. You are going to market your business, but you're going to market it in vibrational form. When you market it in vibrational form, you allow your conscious to give the business to the world so when you give the business to the world people who need that business will find you in any any other way you will do minimal marketing like really minimal marketing but that will be the most impactful marketing for you so yeah i can explain it the whole day but um it's just what you you can't um have what you are not so if you are marketing to gain money that money you must be it for it to come to you so in in the most simplest way that's what it is so okay come through on the 25th join the course and then there's the friday group oh my goodness my favorite place in the world is the favorite group is the friday group because in the friday group what we do is now i'm talking to you about certain concepts certain things um and 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 all sorts of other things guys you can just keep putting your questions up i'll read them i see Swedish just put a question up about the course so i'm just keep putting them up I'll, I'll read them just now now so the friday group is all i live for because in the friday group what we do is now i'm talking to you about certain concept i am saying to you guys you know sometimes when you think this this is what happens sometimes when you are uh, focused on this this is what happens so like i was just saying now when you focus on finding money to make money then you actually lose out because that is actually not how life works you're supposed to be the money for you to gain the money so but on the friday group 
we practice it. So in the Friday group, we have physical exercises that we do to change the mindset. So if you are saying, you know what, I understand that I might just be stopping my own success, my own progress by what I think about the things that I'm doing, by, by what I think about money, by what I think about the failure that I have. Do you actually guys, you know that you need to understand and know exactly how much value you are every hour of your life. Like right now, you're supposed to know that I am worth this much for this hour. You need to know that information. And it's not because it shouldn't come from somebody who's paying you and say, you know, a month I pay you 10 rand, so it means that and for you an hour is 10 cent. That is someone who's telling you what you're worth. But you need to know your true worth. You need to know your own true worth. Because when you know your own true worth, that is when you attract that kind of money, that kind of value. So, and it's not just supposed to come from your job or your business. It's supposed to come from the universal energy. And that's when you get the things you want. So when you said, I wanted a house that is this many millions, and you, you look at your uh, your salary pay slip and it does not uh, accommodate it, it's not that you can't have it. Because you are, you, you, having a house is a universal project. It's not a, a, a job project. So when you don't understand your value, you then give another person to tell you how much you worth and that is wrong that is so wrong then that's all you have then your job or your business and how much it makes and that's it so you've closed all other opportunities you've closed all other doors of getting what you really want so i mean monks i'll I'll, I'll give you a simple example monks don't take any payments so they don't have any money they don't have bank accounts they don't have anything but monks they travel in business class they 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 are they are they, they are shuffled. they they eat whatever they want they sleep wherever they want they have everything they need but they don't have money they don't use money they understand that the universe gives them exactly what they want and it's not through anything else like a job like a business like whatever so um yeah <laughs> i can't even remember what i was <laughs> referring to just now okay so that Friday group, I was talking about the Friday group. So the Friday group, currently we are, we have a seven week series and we are currently on week three and it's great. Like the exercise is amazing. This week we're starting, or this week Friday we're starting week four. If you want to join in on that, please just send me an inbox or an email and I'll add you on the Friday group and you can practice with us. And the fact that we are in a group, the vibration is a little bit much stronger than when you're doing it alone. So it makes sense to do it in a group and then we, we're doing this, all this kinds and crazy stuff that totally changes your mind, like totally, totally changes your mind. Okay, so let's do what we want, I wanted us to do today. How to keep the money vibe flowing how to keep your how to 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 keep your your money the great money that you want in a stable stable sustainable flow so it, it it's not coming in and and then there's nothing in and there's nothing so you just have so when you say i want to end this much a month it is a substantial sustained maintained flow so you, it's not like I have, I don't, I have, I don't. I, so you, we don't want that. We want it. To, well, not not that there is a bad thing, but if you don't want that, then you can make it to not happen. I mean, so the book discussion is on that today. So my book, my name, Black People. So if you are wanting to hear more on that topic on how to keep your flow going right, so to buy the book. It's available on Amazon.com if you would like to download it like me. <laughs> I know. Uh, if you guys don't want to download it, you just want it physical. That's good. And you can have it physical. So if you want it physical, you can just go log on to my website, bustiselecho.com, and order it online. It will, it will be delivered to your door. So it could be work, it could be at home. Within two days of you buying it online, so do that. Uh, it's got great chapters like uh, last week we were doing money and women money and men we're doing money and men for june for the father's day we're talking I i'm just really gonna enjoy doing money and men i know i always do <laughs> because um yeah it's fun to talk to men about men i don't know why but it's just fun 
so uh we we have so many other chapters like black text you know how does it affect you how do you use it correctly to impact your money life your money story your money situation so and well that's the one part there's two parts of this book and then the other part is a 30-day money mindset program so that program is on the book and it's 30 days of mental exercises that you will do to have a better relationship with money you know the other day i was talking about the fact that you know money shouldn't be bullying you and telling you you can't go on holiday you can't buy a car you can't buy a house this much you 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 shouldn't be listening you shouldn't be saying yes to money about stuff that you want so you want to have a better relationship with money so there is the 30 day money mindset program in the book so definitely get the book send through an email send any box and order your book it will be delivered in two days time to you so other than that there's a whole lot of people in this south africa if you are in south africa everyone who's not in south africa just use the website or the kindle if you're in south africa there's a whole lot of other people in different processes like bumalanga wheat bank nail spray um cape town and all those places that have the book so you can buy from them you can just send me an inbox and ask i'll also tell you who is close to you so but today we are on episode 39 of 365 and we are talking about how to make that money flow to be stable so if just think of this if you um you've just got a, a, a job so you, you are given a contract that says you have this job for the next three years the one thing that you know for sure is that the, well today is no, one it's day one of three years but the thing that you know is that for the next three years i do have a job so which means that i do have a salary for the next three years how does that make you feel one of the things is that you can confirm with yourself that i do have the job or what i wanted so you're not going to wake up tomorrow and look for another job you're not gonna wake up tomorrow and worry about a job for the next three years so let's say then they said it's permanent which is like well you can have it until you die so just even think better so you're not gonna be thinking that um i'm going to look for another job um you know if if, if someone asked you your problems like in love looking for a job will not be one of them because you just got a job yesterday and you are okay so you are great now when you so that is when you know you're starting up this job and then and then and then obviously maybe a year later you're like oh my goodness i would love to have more money um and then i will have so this is great but i would love to have more so or you have a business and you're saying um i would love to my business to make a little bit more so when you start to notice that you don't have something that is when the problem starts when you when you are given the job a letter that letter is everything that confirms that you don't have to worry about a job for the next three years or for the rest of your life because this is a permanent post so you just got it a permanent post and you are sorted for life in this job that's it you don't have to worry about it and for now it's really uh, maybe it's just for that time that you are excited about it so you are then in a situation where you would know and your subconscious will know that you have this this is confirmed this is done and the thing is that you have not gone through the three years you have not proved your to yourself that really really i do have three years even if you do you know like maybe you die tomorrow you don't know but like you've you've you you've received this confirmation and you are happy and you believe in this confirmation and that everything is sorted out now that you have the job so but if they did not give you a three years contract they said you know what come work today if you do well we, we will call you again tomorrow if you do well the next day you will be here again if, if you do well, so th there's nothing confirmed that is when you will be forever worrying about the fact that will they call me tomorrow again will they call me tomorrow again? will they so you will never find that rest you will never find that comfortability you will not so that's the same thing with money 
most of the times we are always worried and not sure that we will get what we want so you want that car you like oh my god i'm not sure if i'll get it you want that house you you either give up on you you or you are always worried that you will not get it or now you've got it but you worried that will i be able to make the payment will i pay it will it be paid will this month end? will i be able to pay for it will i have enough money? Sorry guys, my phone just rang. So you worry that, would I, will I, will I, will I? So all that energy that you are now spending worrying about the fact that will tomorrow come, will tomorrow be provided for, is the problem. So the fact that you're stressing so much about the fact that you might have or might not have the money is the issue. So when you got this letter that confirmed that you have a job for the next three years or confirmed that you have a job for the next 12 years, you rested in that area of your life. So, and the rest will keep the flow calm going. Because the thing is that probably um, you could mess up and, no, and, 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 and they can cancel the contract. The contract is cancelable. It's not like we take you we take you no there is terms and conditions in that contract that says if you don't do this and this and this even if we do give you 12 years contract but if you do this and this and this it will be cancelled tomorrow but the fact that you have that promise that you are gonna be fine for the next 12 years is what gives you the confirmation that you don't have to worry so and then you don't worry so when you worried about what you need or what you don't have you then create the commotion in your vibration that you don't have and the only thing that will happen is that your subconscious mind will try to prove to you that you don't have so that is why then some months you will be great some months you will be down because every time you feel more energy towards oh i'm not sure if this is gonna work oh, i'm not sure if i'm gonna be able to fix it and then you are sending the energy you are sending the i don't have i don't have there there your subconscious mind is replying to you with situations where you don't have so it is not about the fact that you can't make the money you know how to make the money you have the resources you have the skills you know how to make the money you you actually have the stock if you if you need a business you have the stock you can do work like it's not like you've run out of stuff to do for you to earn money you have stuff to do but the only thing is that you in your mind have created a i don't have activity that needs to happen so if you've created the activity that says i don't have it needs to happen this activity so it needs to run through the belt and happen so how will it happen you will not have which will come through as not having clients come through as not getting what you want so what i'm saying is that how do you keep your money flow running is with you knowing that i have the skills that are needed for me to earn i have the skills that are needed for me to earn so there is no problem with me doing work that is going to give me money now the fact that you're thinking how am i going to find wh whoever wants this skill is not your issue that is the other thing when you then what about things that are not your business you lose focus so knowing that you have the skills to provide for you to gain the money is all you need to focus on so you like i have a full tank of oil that i am ready to sell so i am sorted as long as i have the oil the oil is worth 100k and that means that i have well worth of 100k and that's all you need to focus on focus on what you do have so when you go into a job you hate you probably go there empty like you don't have anything to offer them. when you have a business that you just there for the money you don't have anything to offer but when you understand and recognize the value you have then you change everything because then that knowing that you have something to offer is like that letter that confirms that you have flow for the next three years or the next 12 years or permanent flow. So then you don't worry about the flow coming in because you have it.
So the thing is that everyone in the world is looking for value from you. And when you have the value, you are sorted. So do not be worrying yourself about who's going to want the value, who's going to pay for the value, who's going to recognize the value. You need to recognize the value yourself by knowing it. So that is the issue. You need to know your value. So you could be in a job where they pay you 10 rand a day or 10 rand when in whatever. That is the value they say they think you are worth. But you need to know the real value that you do have. Because that changes everything. That changes everything. But then that means that you need to work on you a little bit. Which is why I say I love the Friday group. Because then we do that. We work on us a little bit more. So that we can come out with these things. These this, this goals that we, we, you know, we are like gold mines. So we need to dig a little bit inside of us and take out that gold. So guys... I hope you got something so if you want to make your flow be sustainable you need to understand what value you have you must at all times have that value. so if you if, if you are a speaker you should be always knowing that I can speak on this like this if you are um, in you know you have stock you 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 know where to get stock you know how much stock cost you so you need to know the value you need to work on yourself and understand you and what's happening then you don't have to worry then you don't have to worry about if the money is going to come because you do have something to offer you are that thing you are that money you want so thank you guys and then i'm just gonna go through and um so if you want to uh, get into this digging a little bit more finding a little bit more join us on the friday group Definitely do that. Um, just send me an email or an inbox. Then you'll be part of this digging stuff. Okay, so I'm just gonna I'm just gonna look at the few questions that you guys have posted here about the skill course. Okay, so Zueli said, "How, how when the passion is not enough, but the catch is, I can open it easily." So, okay, so um, Zueli is talking about passion. That is not enough. And then he wants to open up the passion. So I think he's saying that he knows something that he knows how to do great, but he does not have the passion for it. So really, if it is a primary, um, it is a primary skill for you, but you don't have passion for it. It might not be that you don't have passion for it. It may just be that you gave up on it. You're like, oh, you, oh, no, man, really? Uh, you you can't do much you just like you just that thing that is looking at me and i know that you don't have much value so you might have given up on the value of what that skill can do for you hence you don't have the passion so you need to find out if it's it's, it's because you've given up on the fact that this this uh, skill can 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 be so valuable in your life or it's just that maybe it's not your primary skill there is another primary skill because if it's a secondary skill then it's not a, a, a like on top of your list type of skill so um yeah we definitely can you can book a session with me we can sit down and find out um why is it not so why why, why are you not feeling that much passion around it so we can do a one-on-one -on -one coaching session and and do that and find out why you are not feeling the goosebumps around it okay so tabita says i'm saying like putting pamphlets at my gate and big board okay so tabita yes tabita you are going to market but tabita you know what you can put your pamphlets as much as you want you could put them everywhere but if um you're not sending the right vibe no one is gonna look at the pamphlet if they look at the pamphlet they will just take it and throw it in the dustbin so what's the point of putting out pamphlets if they are not going to be looked at so do you really want to put out pamphlets that are not going to give you anything back because like you can ask people who have done pamphlets they will tell you that i've done pamphlets for so long but nobody ever comes through like nobody comes even if i say it's free i put up pamphlets and i say it's free they do, still don't come so <laughs> you will do the marketing but the marketing that you do needs to be fueled with the right vibration from your side from your inner self so that when you do put the pamphlet out people do read it and come and and, and use your service or the billboard or whichever way okay i hope tabita that answers your question so then there's philadelphia 
See, she says give the business to the world. Yes, yes, baby. That is what you need to do. You need to understand that you are a gift to the world. You arrived here on planet Earth not for any other reason but to be a gift to the world. So you need to be giving to the world what the world needs from you. And then the world will reward you nicely, like totally great. <laughs> Okay, um, hi Matapelo, hi Milka, hi Kiwi, ugh, this is great guys, hi, 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 so, um, yeah, it looks like I've answered all the questions, I hope if, uh, if I do not answer your question, just send me an inbox or send me an email, and, um, yeah, and I hope to see you on Saturday on 26th in Pretoria for our money master class, or, in one of the events that are happening around everywhere i'm not sure even where like in this week and there's about three events that i'm going to and then yeah other than that thank you so much guys for tuning into episode 39 i will be definitely get doing another episode tomorrow episode 40 tune in when you can or if you not you find other well couldn't tune in now <laughs> so you see the recording or you missed other episodes they are on youtube i load them almost every day they're on youtube my youtube channel is Busy so find them there thank you guys bye bye